Well, it's uh, two days before muzzleloader season, and uh, we just picked up uh, a CVA Optima uh, V2 in iron sights, and we came out to the farm here just to sight it in. So far, um, I gotta say that this is an extremely accurate rifle. We're about to shoot our last uh, shot for our, um, our group. Uh, I'll show you the target there, and. Uh, We'll go over the settings afterwards and see what happens. So as you can see, right out of the box, um, this gun shoots factory to the right and low. This is our group after adjustments, which I'm very pleased with for a muzzle loader. And this is the highest rear adjustment setting at 50 yards and this is the placement of the shot at 50 yards you need a slight adjustment um, and a slight adjustment down and to the so again this is the setting on the rear post for your elevation at 50 yards it is slightly behind the second hash mark. These are the shot placements. Here are factory out of the box. Your elevation is low and to the right. And this is the maximum elevation on the rear aperture. And slightly back from the second from the front this is your grouping now we used two pellets of the triple seven the Hornady mono flex mls and the cci muzzle loader primers with a breech plug from the factory is meant to shoot triple seven pellets and not the Blackhorn 209 loose powder. There is a separate, sold separately, breech plug for loose 209 powder. So now for our windage, again, out of the box, factory settings, shoots to the right ever so slightly this is where we increased our elevation but did not touch the windage shoots to the right and it is a slight windage adjustment to the left now it's very sensitive but a simple tweak will get this group right here Now in moving, moving up to 10 grains to uh, 110, you could see, now this is without swabbing uh, in between shots, but there is no pattern. And as you all know, muzzle loaders are very sensitive to the amount of powder used. This is just a slight increase so 160 grain in combination with 150 grain at 110 grains and there is no grouping. However, two pellets, 
to 50 green pellets at 50 yards. This is a very good group um, for a production gun. And this is where you want to be at 50 yards, an inch, inch and a half high. Again, this is the Optima V2 stainless steel with Duracite. <laughs>